to go all the way up there. So let's get it, man. I'm dying right now. I'll just call you back, y'all. It's too much talk. 750. I'll call you back. I'm dead. Today, I'm at the meetup point at San Jose Castillo, San Jose Church. Looks nice out here, man. Beautiful. I'll show you guys. This is San Jose Church. That's pretty old. I'm going to go inside, but I'll show you all a little bit of that. This is the meetup spot. Some big surprise. You guys are in for some big surprise mistakes. So I'm heading towards the bus right now. They told me I can go to the bus. So we can go to our destination. I think it's about an hour ride, so. Here's this bus right here. Chicos, ¿quién desea salsa picante? <laughs> <laughs> the dog's going crazy. <laughs> Stop for breakfast, y'all. It's raining out here. It's cold. It's like 65 degrees. It's not that bad, so. <laughs> So this is the breakfast they offer us. Uh, what a tour. Could be like yesterday. Looks pretty appetizing. <laughs> I think this is out here. It's my first time I've had it. So guys, we are in Guatape. It is raining and it's cold. I didn't bring a jacket. But this is Guatape. It's cold out here. I was not prepared for this. This is terrible. I'm gonna wait for this call. Oh man. It's so cold. So I guess we're exploring the city for a little bit. Before we go to the big rock. Umbrella, Selling umbrellas out here. Because it's raining. That's so cool. Look at that taxi. It is raining out here. I guess we're about to watch a show. It's like a big umbrella on top. I don't like these umbrellas in there. Church about the entire church right now. All around us. It's a rainy day. Man, this is gorgeous. Kind of gotta stay quiet. You know. <laughs> Sound of a whisper. It's like a Catholic church. Check this out. It's kind of cool. Alright guys, 
It's time to roll out. Guys, I'm so cold. Uh, come to traveling, man. You just never know what to expect sometimes. But it is what it is. I'll show you some of the houses. You want that bit? Hey. So pretty out here, man. It's, it's crazy. Oh, they got jacket. Hey, jacket. <laughs> they got a sweater. <laughs> Maybe I'll buy one. Really? Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> Yo, check out the coat, man. I feel like a lion right now. Um, my favorite video game, they call it Assassin's Creed. <laughs> I was too close, so I had to get one. It's time to go. <laughs> we got New York pizza out here, man. You want some New York pizza? <laughs> Surprised how much food they got out here, man, from all over the world. It's, it's amazing, man. It blows my mind, really. Famous umbrella spots. Yeah. Everybody's trying to take a picture right now. I feel like it would be pretty if it was, uh, if it was raining. Suddenly? Yeah. Oh yeah, painting up the wall. This is amazing. All the way up, y'all. So colorful out here. This is the most colorful city in South America. Looks like a shopping mall. <laughs> it's like the shopping mall of Colombia. Literally. Bakery, y'all. Uh, check out the bakery. Chiquita Cantina, small bar? Yeah, yeah small bar. Chiquita Cantina. Hola. Hola. Let's go. Conversation. Sunny down here. Sunny down here. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
waiting, waiting to go climb this rock. We need to check this out. Hey, man. to the rock yo one of the largest rocks in South America let's check out the views over here guys man this is gorgeous it's so beautiful out here alright let's head towards the rock let's go so the rock has 750 steps 650 stairs so it's gonna take 750 steps to go all the way up there so let's get it man this is amazing It's mind blowing out here, man. It's crazy. So, a family owns this rock and they bought it with three cows. Now they're the richest family in Colombia. One of the richest family in Colombia. Imagine. It's like about seven or eight dollars per person, 25,000 pesos. If my math is correct, just imagine. Check it out, man. Got restaurants, bars. This is beautiful. Time to go. This is amazing. Are you all ready for this? Let's go. I'm already at like 70 steps. I'm out of breath, man. Yo, this is crazy. Taking a pause for a minute. Soak in the moment. 
Ah, that's something. I'm at 150 steps. <laughs> it's hard, but okay, it's big right now. We gotta keep going. This is no joke, man. You come out here. You gotta get ready to be out of breath. This is crazy. 225 steps. 550 more to go. About that. <laughs> I'm at 300 steps. 300 steps. There's a break point up there. I'm gonna try to make it up there. Let's keep going. That coat I'm wearing is not helping either. It's making it harder. 225. Let's go. All the way up there, y'all. This is cool. Oh yeah. You're vlogging or are you just taking this one? Yeah, vlogging. Sorry. My friends from Germany. What's up, What's YouTube? Up? <laughs> My guys liking the steps, man. Uh, it's okay. crazy, right? Okay. We're halfway there, I think. It's getting hot. Yeah. <laughs> With your punch. 350, baby. 350. 400 more, y'all. Take it also the altitude. Yeah. Wow. Air Lorraine said. Air Lorraine said. She's like, Air Lorraine said. I'm getting lightheaded. Oh, damn, bro. Don't pass out. I had to take my coat off. That was the cop. Okay. Got my man back. He hurt me. Sorry, guys. She's tired, man. She's tired. This ain't no joke. I'm dying right now. I'll call you back, y'all. It's too much talking. 550. I'll call you back. I'm dead, y'all. I'm done. Man. Right. The stuff I do for YouTube, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo. Lord. I'm gonna make it now. Let's go. 625. We got 625. Let's go. 625 stops. 650. Oh. Yo, I'm done. I'm sorry. Oh, more stairs, guys. Oh man, we made it. We made it to the top. We made it, guys. We made it. A lot of plugs out here. So beautiful. There's a lot of bugs. So we made it, guys. You see it right here? Yes, sir. A lot of bugs here. Back down. I keep hitting my head because I'm so tall. But it's nice up there, but there's a lot of bugs. I wish there wasn't so many bugs, but I guess it's cool. The exit is this way. Oh wow, they got um, they're doing something over here. That's kind of cool. Time to go, y'all. Time to go back. 
If I can get some water because I need it right now. I need some water. Let's just enjoy this moment. One last time. Man, just check out the views. It's so beautiful, man. We're traded for the world. <laughs> Top of the world. So it was raining this morning, but now it's starting to clear up, so that's a good thing. So much easier, y'all. Yeah. Going down right now. <laughs> so much easier to go down. It's kind of scary, though. You don't want to miss a step. Yes, sir. We made it, man. We made it. Went all the way up. 750 steps, y'all. World record. I need, a light, I need a nice lunch after this. Something good. It's a different route to go down versus when you go up. It's so much easier. Is it worth it? It's worth it for the views, but I didn't like the bugs. So much bugs. I don't know because of the weather or what. Yeah. You can kind of see how far down it came from. So we got a lot to go. All the, all the way to the bottom. Look how narrow this is. Yeah, insane. We're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Mm. Almost there, y'all. Gotta watch my step. No, I'm full. <laughs> This is the last of it, I think. This thing is a good joke, man. Crazy. All the way from up there. Thank you, God. Oh, we made it down. Woo. Your boy is tired, man. man. Never thought I would make it. Oh. Come here, man. You gotta enjoy it, though. It's hella fun. Let's go through these doors. Oh. We made it out. No glass, no glass. 
El Viejo Penor. We're about to take a boat tour on that lake right there. Um, there's a lot of construction being built out here. As you can see, look at this house right there, man. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's so beautiful. This is El Viejo Penor. That's the sign. Uh, come over here. El Viejo Penor. Yes, sir. So we're gonna wait for that. Go on the boat tour. On our way down to El Viejo. So the lake that we're about to go on, they use this lake for energy. It provides energy to Colombia. So that's how they get, you know, electricity and all that. This lake provides energy for those guys.
Holy Cross. Tiene miedo. Willy, we out here. So we have made it down to the boat side. There's the boats. And the blue boat right there, Orion. We're going on Orion. This is our boat. Let's go Orion. as you can see from here this house is more than 200 years old this house was owned by a doctor called Demetrio Demetrio was very popular in the town because he was like a Robin Hood he was known as the doctor of the poor because once per week he used to give free medicine for the poor people of the town so that's why he was a good man however he was known because he had 36 children with 11 different women so that's why some people say the medicine was not totally free <laughs> <laughs> so uh, he never recognized his children so that's why the house belongs to the government now in front of the boat you will find this big cross uh, is because back in the 90s the government decided to build this cross to represent that in that place the church of the town was located in the past remember in all Colombian towns the church was always in the downtown of the town so now we are selling it the competition of Escobar, the different groups, they sell drugs and guns, so they join in a group called Pepe's. Pepe's stands for persecuted by Pablo Escobar. So the Pepe's came and they throw bombs on the properties. However, Pablo Escobar used to build his houses with double walls, like bunkers. So that's why you can see that after the, bomb, the bombs, houses are standing still. In, uh, in the time Pablo Escobar was here, he used to have 120 bodyguards looking for the whole property, a total of uh, 8 hectares. You will see his private zoo. 
Pablo Escobar used to have access by land, water, and air as well. He used to have a heliport in the property. You will see this beautiful giant house like in the hill, the White House is big. That's, that house is called La Marquesa. La Marquesa was the house Pablo Escobar built for his sister. Uh, his sister was a teacher. So they called, uh, between them, they called this house the little school because she was a teacher. So Pablo Escobar was very clever. So when he was going to meet with his guys, he, he tell them to meet in the little school. Guys, that's my house. Okay, so take a picture. <laughs> Next time we drink coffee. Uh, uh, the house that is next to it on the left side, the small white house, it belongs to James Rodriguez. James Rodriguez is the number 10 of the Colombian soccer team. And next to it, the other white house with the brown roof belongs to David Ospina. David Ospina is the goalkeeper of the Colombian soccer team. Behind the white house, the black house, it belongs to James' ex-wife. So, uh, and you can also see the stone. This is the moment to take a picture of this beautiful landscape, guys. This is the last time we see the rock today. So guys, that was it. That was it for the tour. Right, it's time to go back. Thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far, I appreciate you. Catch y'all on the next one. Until next time, subscribe. Hit the like button. Peace.